A couple of years ago, my wife and I knew we had to get healthier. But the problem was we had no idea where to start. I searched the internet, but everything seemed the same. From gimmicky diets to cheap supplements, everything felt like snake oil. Our doctor recommended the usual. Eat less bad foods, exercise more, and switch to light beer. (laughs) If I had a dollar for every time my doctor told me that, I'd be as rich as him. I felt every time I looked for answers, I was getting the same generic responses. But we tried them anyway. We ordered a few different online supplements, bought some new running shoes, signed up for a gym membership. We were ready to take control of our health. Four weeks later, the running shoes were collecting dust, the supplements sitting in my fridge, and our gym membership was taking up space in our wallets. Just as I expected, nothing was working. We fell back into our usual routine, didn't get any healthier, and just forgot about the little crusade we embarked on. And the worst thing in my life happened. My father had a heart attack. He took everyone by surprise. None of us saw it coming, and it was really hard on my whole family. Just like me, my dad always thought he was healthy enough and that nothing serious would happen to him. Boy, that got me thinking. The doctor already warned me that if I kept up this lifestyle, I would get sick in my older years. That's when I decided to stop relying on the internet or gym membership to get healthy. I was going to create something for myself to make sure I was going to live a long and prosperous life. This is where I came up with what I consider to be the greatest idea I've ever had. An idea so big and so effective that I knew I had to share it with as many people as I could to help them rethink their health. Do you want to know what I did? Tomorrow, I'll be emailing you with that wow idea and how it can help you get your health back on track permanently. Keep an eye out for my email tomorrow. Until next time, this has been James Stewart signing off.